Hope. I pray it's not you. Wait, who was Hope? Was she the girl from the Assassin's Order? We used to partake of him with fresh cream on Sunday. Now the shop is open. All right. Oh, well, cat. Hi, hey, kitty. I tell you, things have been tense since the Jumonville affair. Don't jump out at me. You had to do it, didn't you? Why do you want to fight me now? There's no need for any of this. Oh shit. Oh, maybe he'll let me sneak up to him. Oh shit, he can see me? I have a good line what on the him. fuck? <laughs> Don't fall! It's all gone, though. Trying to give us the hand, <laughs> maggot. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Dead. Am I anonymous now? Thank you. Just knocks. Shay, oh, it is good to see you again. Your friend Hope said you were away. I, I, I was. Uh, sir, I, I've come to collect the results of your experiments. Oh, well, it's a very good thing then. I just finished fixing the prototype. Here you go. I was preparing to leave for Philadelphia, and then Europe. I was invited to lecture in London. Oh, would you be so kind as to inform Mistress Hope? Of course. Bye, Benjamin. God, Hope. What are you doing with these felons? Turning the city against itself. What have you become? Something the matter, Master Cormac? Uh, no, no. Yes, just... It's about to get emotional. Please. When I am issued new recruits burdened with regrets, I tell them the surest way to lose them is with gunpowder. You're right, Colonel.
You should shoot your problems away. This prototype seems very powerful. Use it with care, Master Cormac. Our intelligence says this thing can destroy certain fortifications, as well as injure several enemies at once. There is also a more subtle way to use it. Some of these grenades contain a strong sedative. Fire one into the crowd and they will fall asleep immediately. We should test this new weapon. Use it against that door. Uh, grenade launcher. Jesus Christ. Okay. Go ahead, Master Cormac. Shoot the door. Good work. Good work. I think you are ready to turn this new weapon against the ruffians who have used it. There is an abandoned factory nearby hiding a dangerous poison. Right now, it only causes sleep. But I fear those outlaws are distilling it. A more powerful formula could sicken or perhaps even kill him. <laughs> and that's my first target. Be careful. All the better. Okay, bye. I guess. Come on. You got this, Shay. You're a master assassin. Destroy poison supplies. Oh! Damn it. She's in the bush. For ammo, okay. Wait, how do I destroy them? Screen's shaking all over the place. Are you hmm. If I mess with this, maybe I can break the whole system. Come on, keep walking, Shay. Shay! Shay! Nicky. I must get out, or I'm as good as dead. The whole place will blow up. Resistance is not in your best interest. Desist. Bro. Those already blew up.
Wouldn't you just have released a whole bunch of poison into the air? Ah! What marvelous destruction, Captain! I saw the smoke all the way from the Morrigan! That should discourage those miscreants. New York is safe for now. With all due respect, Colonel, it's going to take more than a few explosions to get rid of this kind of trouble. The boy is right, Colonel Monroe. Shay, was it? Congratulations. You just burned a whole lot of rats out of New York. I'm Jack Weeks. This is William Johnson. I don't know about him, but I'm pleased to meet you. Pleased to meet you as well. It is uh, terribly dusty here. I'm sure Shay can recount his adventures to us over a pint. Hey, the first round's on uh, the curve. <laughs> <laughs> I like this guy. Something the matter, Master Cormac? Just a little confused. I uh, must have breathed some of that gas. Some ale will do you good. Come, we are all friends here. You will be taken care that of. That Weeks guy was from the beginning of the game, right? They're all Templars. Upgrade the various parts of your ship at the harbor masters. Or from your captain's cabin to become more powerful and just defeat stronger ships. I don't know what voice I was doing there, but North Atlantic 1757. Grab that apple. Oh, eats it right through the mask. I picked the best outfit for this cutscene. Oh, a gift. Oh shit, it's that book. It's from Hope. Oh. From the Colonel. Dear Master Cormac. My apologies for the brevity of this missive, but it is time we were honest with one another. You have demonstrated your loyalty and resourcefulness to the Templar cause. And this despite, and perhaps because of, your assassin origins. The manuscript the assassin sought has been in my possession for some time. I reclaimed it when my men found you marooned. The Grand Master himself charged me to discover its meaning, a task I regret I have failed to complete. I leave it in your charge, Master Cormac. There is no one else I okay. trust more. Now I leave for Fort William Henry, an ill-prepared garrison on my single surrounded page by hostile note. natives Copy. and the French army. We have requested reinforcements, but I doubt they will be forthcoming. I have no illusions that our resistance will be successful. I commit my life to the British army and my soul to the Father of Understanding. Yours, Colonel George Aww. Monroe. Cute. Six hundred bones. Okay, what outfit should we go with next? Let's go with Altair's outfit. Chili out. Captain's help! Let out some sail! Find your post, guest. The Colonel's in trouble. How do you mean, in trouble? He's at Fort William Henry, facing impossible odds. Get off your lazy asses, lads! And man your stations! We raise anchor! 
Sorry for the early libation, Captain. But do you realize that it's been a whole year since we met? A whole year! Changed my life, you did. And for the better. <laughs> you will uh, forgive me if I have been uh, celebrating oh, without This you. guy's cute. A whole year. Guest, I have a question for you. How long have you known of my, well, former allegiance? Oh, you mean the assassins? I knew that ages ago, Shay. I may be drunk, but I'm not blind. Or did you think I would assume you had escaped from some homicidal <laughs> circus? Why didn't you say anything? Well, the colonel wanted us to avoid the subject so it wouldn't, you know, influence your decision making. You saved my life out of pure selfless instinct and helped countless others besides. If it were up to me, I would have made you an official Templar oh, well. months ago. Who is it up to then? Monroe mentioned the Grand Master. Oh yes, the Grand Master of a colonial right. You'd like him, Shay. His father was an assassin. Really? He must have a story to tell. What is the news from Fort William Henry? The garrison is surrounded, and reinforcements are late. General Montcalm has been blazing a path across the colonies for King Louis, hasn't he? I rather wish he'd stayed home with his masters. Here's our King Louis. Either. Though I suspect the king's is fine. Indeed. Madame O'Murphy is supposed to be quite the charmer. And O'Murphy is in the French king's bed. Now I know you're pulling my leg. New naval missions. Pass. Okay, is it before this turn or after this turn? Oh, it's well after. Keep to the right. Oh, don't ram any ships that you don't want to start a fight with. Floating cargo for the taking, sir. Whoops. Well, the rain it is raining all the day long. Taking these ships off some dope jumps. Okay. As much sail as you can. Loose topsails, gallants and royals. Wash away the stretch of fishnets. As we were fishing off Haysboro Line. What's that boat doing? And then holding and trolling all night in that windy old weather. Stormy old weather. When the wind blows, it all falls together. When up to the wind. That's not how wind works. Slashing his tail, 
time now. Old skipper, to hoist up your oh, sail in the wind, the old weather. So me old weather. When the wind blows, we all fall together. And up jumps a slip soul as strong as a horse. <laughs> 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 comes a place who's got spots on his side says not much longer he sees you can ride in oh don't hit the land floating cargo for the taking three wood as long as a mile winds come in he says just snagging some wood oh my god what are you doing ship these guys are crazy. Wait, is that on the other side of this island? No, it's there. Okay. I think I'm gonna trade in my goofy outfits for just the normal Shea outfit. Off the wind. Oh! Clue up. Clue up. Don't hurt my ship. Ooh, a new fast travel location. Oh wait, no, I don't want that. God, Shay. What you doing, Weeks? Shay. What was it fucking daytime all of a sudden? Like Holy shit. Jack. Colonel Monroe surrendered to General Moncal. The French and their Abenaki allies took Fort Henry. Johnson was supposed to bring reinforcements here. I don't see anyone else. The Abenaki are restless. They don't understand the terms of surrender and refuse to heed Moncal. The colonel and his men were released this morning. They're walking into an ambush. Wait here in case Johnson arrives. I'll... I'll protect the colonel. Thank you. Maybe I can finally repay my debt to him. Oh yeah, because he saved my life, didn't he? Too late. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. Now I know what it's like to be on the other side of all the Assassin's Creed games. It's horrible! Did not see that coming. I hope I'm not too late.
Oh shit. Well, hello. Master Cormac. Sir, we must hurry. We should bring what's left of your man to the Morgan. A welcome offer, Captain Cormac. Follow me. Safe passage Not really. ahead. If you don't mind me asking, what happened at Fort William Henry? Poor planning and poor luck, I am afraid. Montcalm was able to bombard us for days. Damn frog. Actually, he acted with great honor. When we sent for Parley, he returned an offer far more generous than anticipated. He kept our arms, and more importantly, our colors. Only to walk into a trap. I would hardly expect the French to defend us. Would you? No, I wouldn't. You continue to prove your loyalty to the Templars, Master Cormac. Risking your life for me. We're not out of the woods yet, Colonel. As for my loyalty, well, I do owe you, don't I? You saved my life gave me a second chance. We have been working together for a year now. During that time, you have rendered many great services. Whatever debt you imagine you have towards me is paid, wouldn't you say? Perhaps. Uh-oh. Assassiones! Oh no, it's my friends. You live! Attack! Take cover! What? Together, men! I'll take out as many as I can. Oh, this guy's broken. Moving. I'll scout ahead and signal if there's trouble. Sensible strategy. Let's go. Might as well synchronize while I'm up here before I jump down and start killing. Oh, there's my ship. You're dead. You're dead.
Where was that wall I could climb? Oh, it's right there. Go, 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 go! Bye! Come on. 